the four by 400 meters relay. Where they go first time. Nylander for Sweden went off very quickly. And David Jenkins right on the outside has gone storming away as usual. He's got the lead down the back straight, runs the 300 first, uh, 300 very fast indeed, and then usually hangs on. The Soviet Union is closing up, and the West German going well too. He's in lane three, and that is Skamarov. Manea there of Italy, the camera's concentrating on, did not run a very good leg last night, and they've changed their running order. On the near side, then, is David Jenkins of Great Britain, but the stagger doesn't unwind until the beginning of the back straight on the second leg. Jenkins hanging on, West Germans are going well, so too are the Soviet Union. And Italy, well placed as well. Czechoslovakia is at the moment struggling on the inside. Jenkins on to Cook, but the Soviet Union with uh, Rushin on the second leg are going well, and so too are Poland on the inside and West Germany. They're coming to the breaking point, and Gary Cook has got to come a long way across. It's West Germany leading, Poland in second place, the Soviet Union goes second, and Great Britain fourth, and Cook coming across all the time, trying to take the pole, which he has done. So it's Harold Schmidt now, of West Germany leading, the Soviet Union in second place, Gary Cook of Great Britain third, Poland struggling, and Czechoslovakia trying to get back in the picture. Gary Cook really hanging on, a two-lap specialist, but he's run a marvellous leg here, and now trying to take the Russian. It's Harold Schmidt for West Germany, who leads, and Great Britain going to second place, but come out in third. It wasn't a good change. It's Todd Bennett now chasing the Soviet athlete, who's Konobala. Into the back straight, and the West Germans leading through Thomas Giesing. Then the Soviet Union in second place. Oh, and look at that. That may be suicidal. He's gone so early. So, the Soviet Union take the lead, but what's he done? Let's see what he's got left. West Germany in second place. Todd Bennett, a good leg for Great Britain third. Bennett hanging onto the curb and going the short way. But the Soviet athlete tying up and trying to hang on. And Bennett coming on the near side. And the Soviet athlete run a marvellous leg there. Great Britain goes second, ahead of the favourites, West Germany. And so on the last leg is the Soviet Union leading. In second place, Phil Bennett for Great Britain. And Weber. The West German European champion, the number one in Europe this year, goes up into second place. And Bennett trying to stop him, but Weber goes through. A tremendous battle for this gold medal. And West Germany and the Soviet Union leading. Britain in the bronze position, and Bennett is beginning to close. He's tried to save something. West Germany and the Soviet Union blocking the track, and Great Britain having to come on the outside. Bennett had to switch and lost ground, and here comes West Germany. Favour of West Germany, driving for the take. West Germany went great for second. The Soviet Union third. Poland four. Czechoslovakia five. A tremendous run by Todd Bennett, but he suddenly found himself coming up Phil Bauer Brown right on the last leg. He suddenly faced two athletes who were like a wall in front of him and had to make the decision as to whether to go wide. Perhaps in retrospect, it may have been wiser to wait, but he had a go. And Great Britain, in any case, do better than they could have expected in taking the silver medal.